You're listening to the WBT Podcast with Michael Lodge. Listen to all of our podcasts at www.wbtpod.com. Stay informed. Let's get started. This is brought to you by Lodge & Co., a business and tax advisory firm where your success is our goal. Call us today toll-free at 888-681-1518 or visit us at www.lodge-co.com and learn more about what we can do for you. Lodge & Co., your source for sound business and tax services. And welcome to the WBT. This is Michael Lodge. Glad you joined me. Listen, you know where people make the biggest mistakes in business or in sports or entertainment? It has to do with the people that they surround themselves with. And when you choose badly, and sometimes it's really tough because these are friends who have been with you for a long time. Sometimes they're moms or dads or uncles or cousins or whoever they may be who are trying to advise you, but they don't know what they're doing. I tell you, I have represented some very big boxers the top of the boxes in the world. And the biggest problem that we always had in helping these guys out is that there are people surrounding them who are literally trying to suck them dry of their finances because they think they're going to get something and they literally take all the money that the boxer has earned. I've seen this so many different times where they surround themselves with people who is a cousin of a cousin who said they know everything about taxes or business and they know absolutely nothing. And they're advising this boxer or this sports athlete into doing things that they should not do. These guys are leeches. I mean, they literally are leeches. I had one boxer who wanted to buy a Ferrari. So his business manager went and made a deal with the Ferrari, but the deal was, hey, listen, listen, let me tell you something. Add another 100000 to it, you and I will split the hundred k. He'll pay for it. Don't worry about it. Money's no object. He'll pay for the car. If you, if you add another 100000 onto it, it's okay. You and I make fifty k. You make fifty k. So you have all of these people around him or around them trying to leech off of them and suck the guy dry of all of his money. That's why so many boxers at the end of their career, they have nothing left because they listened and they surrounded themselves with the wrong people. And you, if you do that also, if you just invite anybody in because they were a friend or a buddy or an aunt or even your mom or dad, and if they don't know what they're doing and if they provide no value to you, Get rid of them because they are going to destroy your financial situation. If you want to make money, surround yourself with the very best people. Two people you have to have. A really good business attorney and a really good tax accountant. Those two individuals are going to make or break you. So, if you invite other people who who are telling you, yeah, my cousin knows this, my cousin knows that, be independent and make your own decision and find the person that you want to surround yourself with. You know, it's really good to have friends and it's really good to have family members around you when you make it big or when you have created a really successful business. But sometimes, and about 85% of the time, They are going to advise you to do the wrong thing. I've seen it happen time after time after time. Not just in boxing, but in other athletic sports and also in the entertainment industry. I see it all the time with people who are really good at what they do. They have a talent for what they do. But the worst talent is managing their financial side or the business side of their art form or their sports. And the same thing with small businesses. When you're starting out, surround yourself with people who are going to guide you and direct you, but they know what they're doing. They must offer you value. If you see that they're not offering you any value, get rid of them as soon as possible. 
it's amazing. You know, I've been doing this for a long time, since 1984, and I have had senior executives. I have had co-generation power plants. I've had entertainment, real estate, construction, you name it. I've pretty much dealt with that industry. And I've always tried to advise my clients, stay within compliance, monitor your financial statements, and make sure you know how to read your financial statements. And that way you can manage well and hire the people that bring to you the value of their profession. Not because they're a cousin, not because they're an aunt or uncle or anything like that. That's not a good reason to be paying people. You pay people for the hour of value that they provide you. Always remember that because, listen, I have seen this so much in my line of work where we have really successful, or they could be really successful people, but they get drained by too much money going out. So my point to you today is think a little bit. Think about the individuals that surround you. Think about those individuals who you don't know exactly what they're doing, but they're there with you every single time. They're eating the food that you're paying for. They're flying on the corporate jet that you're paying for. They're staying in really fancy hotels that you're paying for. But what are their value to you? Remember, every person that you hire has to have some type of value. And they have to live up to that value. So that's my suggestion for you today is surround yourself <clears throat> with really, really good people that know what they're doing. Sometimes it's really tough to push all of those friends and relatives to the side. And sometimes you have to be very blunt and say, Hey, listen, Bob, I do not want you involved in my business anymore. Sam, I don't want you involved because you don't bring me any value. You don't need this whole posse that goes along with you wherever you go. All that you need is a core group of individuals that each have a talent to get you to where you need to go. So focus on that. Focus on surrounding you, surrounding yourself with the individuals who bring you value. This is Mike Lodge for the WBT. If you have any questions, just send me an email at mlodge at lodge-co.com and I'll be more than happy to answer any question that you may have. Talk to you very, very soon. Thank you for listening to the WBT with Michael Lodge. Join us again tomorrow as we explore more about business and taxes. Follow us on iHeartRadio and go to our podcast website at www.wbtpod.com and listen to all of our podcasts and read our blogs. World of Business and Taxes on WBT. This is brought to you by Lodge & Co., a business and tax advisory firm where your success is our goal. Call us today toll-free at 888-681-1518. Or visit us at www.lodge-co.com and learn more about what we can do for you. Lodge & Co., your source for sound business and tax services.